Jason White, Head of Sport at Loretto. My name is Rick Valentine, I'm Director of Golf at Loretto School. My name's Archie White, I'm in fifth form and I come from Argyle. My name's Jack Pearson, uh, I'm going to upper sixth uh, and I'm 17. My name's Ailey Henderson, I'm 15, I'm from Fife and I'm in the lower sixth. My name's Kit McKenzie, um, I've been in school for eight years now. I think my parents thought that's probably the school for me. I love the whole sort of nature of the school, how it's small and how everyone sort of knows each other. You don't have someone just doing music or just playing sport, you have everyone doing music and sport. So it's sort of different and everyone does everything um, and supports everyone in their sort of what they want to do. I was fortunate enough, I worked hard, um, came through and went on to play for Scotland, captain Scotland, um, was selected for the British and Irish Lions in 2005 and had a, had a great club career. So I left rugby with some great memories and it's, it's great to be back in an environment here where I can use all the knowledge that I, that I learned over my, my years as a professional rugby player. I've been here since 2003. The Golf Academy opened in 2002. So I've been developing the golf program here at Loretto for quite a long time now. So the boys have three major sports. So the, the autumn term is rugby, the spring term is hockey, and the summer term we go to cricket. And for the girls, the autumn term is hockey, spring term is lacrosse, and summer term is tennis. They're then supported in our environment here with great facilities, both at the school with our indoor training centre. We've got outdoor practice facilities as well, and then surrounded by a host of fantastic Lynx golf courses. The best thing for me is right on the doorstep. So, I mean, as soon as I finish classes, I'm straight in here. And then when I've got free periods, I can come in here and have my one-to-one -one sessions and it's, it's a good way to get away from the classroom and just sort of de-stress in a way. That's probably my highlight, playing in front of the whole school, standing on the pitch and looking sort of stand and you're seeing the whole school watching you and cheering you on and things. I think that's sort of a special thing that I won't forget. It's, you know, it's something Loretto prides itself on is it being a small school um, and so that does mean coaches get you know, a wider chance and a greater opportunity to be able to find time to that one-on-one -on -one, uh, coaching with you. Um, and that can really help you develop when, you know, you, you know, it's just you and the coach working on your technical, um, you know, technical advances in whatever sport you're playing. Um, and that is probably the greatest thing that one director can offer with sport. It's always fantastic to see your pupils go on and represent their countries. George Munsey was a standout in cricket. We've had Lorna Crawford in hockey who's represented Scotland, went over to America on a hockey scholarship. So, so it's great and we wish them well and we're, we're very proud of them when they go on. You've got to come. Uh, it is a great school with so many different opportunities, academic or drama or through music or sport. Um, and there's a boarding opportunity that no other school really offers here in Scotland with flexi boarding. If you're looking for a school with uh, many opportunities to go down sort of any sort of path, come to Loretta.